to give you an idea where Grenada is, here's Florida and here's Grenada. And if we zoom in, there's Grenada.
Grenadians are uh, in the mountain regions and striking back when they can. Most of the American students are safely back in the U.S. And they are publicly thanking the U.S. troops for their intervention and rescue. And of course they were worried about becoming hostages of the Cubans. A couple days ago, the 82nd Airborne uh, used their Black Hawk kilos and continued their airborne assault into some of the known Cuban Army military camps. And our Indy Air Wing uh, supported that with both A6s and A7 strikes. The residents of the capital, uh, St. George's, uh, are welcoming the U.S. forces within their, their town. Uh, and they're also helping to identify and point out locations for the various hidden Cuban arms and uh, things like that. In the aircraft have uh, continued their assault on targets in support of the U.S. forces. The other day, uh, we had some uh, VA-15, VA-176 uh, spectacular explosions in some ammunition storage areas. Apparently, it's been common for the Soviet and Cuban trained folks to decentralize their storage areas, and when one of those torches off, it's apparently a spectacular sight. <laughs> also, the other day, uh, some VA-87 aircraft used their 20 Mike Mike uh, to warn off some fast cabin cruiser small boats that were trying to escape uh, to the north, and uh, that action uh, succeeded in forcing those boats to return to the south. The big honcho uh, that uh, was responsible for that Marxist coup uh, a couple weeks ago is, is still um, uh, at large and they're trying to track him down but apparently he's staying one jump ahead of the U.S. forces. Uh, of interest, however, we have a lot of his personal documents and things and uh, I suppose they're in Washington by now. Of course, we're continuing our around-the-clock support, and we'll continue throughout today. Uh, some of our attack aircraft uh, yesterday uh, again strafed some military camps and uh, tried to clear uh, that area of anti-personnel mines. Marines and Airborne have linked, and uh, they've uh, pretty much secured the perimeters of this in the southern area and moving around the island, particularly to the north. Marines still control the Pearl Airport, which is in the northeast, although there is still some sporadic fighting in that area. A very interesting event. Uh, last night we were tasked to drop leaflets over portions of the island. This was an effort uh, to bring the conflict to a rapid conclusion, and how this was performed uh, was, first of all, uh, Indy, uh, prepared 750,000 safe conduct pass leaflets. And these were sewn over the central and northern portion of the island, dropped by HS-15 aircraft, piloted by Commander Feeling, the CO, and Lieutenant Commander Smith from Air Wing 6. I'm happy to announce that that was a successful mission. It was a dangerous mission, but uh, totally successful. Now, how, how effective the leaflets are, we'll have to wait and see. The F-32 continues to perform their short-fuse TARPS mission. Now, TARPS is the photographic uh, uh, capability that we have, and would you believe we have to date uh, processed over 20 miles of film? And this has been processed and analyzed and uh, used for bomb uh, damage assessment and for intelligence purposes. This afternoon, we're going to do an ordnance overload with Sir Bachi, who is uh, within visual range right now. That's going to be a long, busy evolution, so we want to stay out of the way, and of course we're going to be still flying simultaneously during that evolution. No word has been obtained from here yet on on the future of the amphibious group or, or our indie group, and that is when we will pull out or, or go to, a, to another tasking. Parts and mail are continuing to come in, but today we only got one C-1 flight aboard, and they're having some availability problems, and in one instance they have been given some other tasking. I suspect tomorrow we'll resume with more C-1 flights. So let's keep up our safe and outstanding performance. I'll keep
keep you posted as other things break. That is all.